Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Marilyn Darling Show, and welcome to another episode of an Ink Review. Today, we are looking at another orange-ish ink, this one from the Birmingham Pen Company, Apple Snail. Thanks go out to Gary and Kathy Scott for providing the sample for this review. Today's pen will be using the Doodler's Conrad with a Fountain Pen Revolution Ultra Flex Nib. Alright, here is our comparison panel. This is a nice orangey brownie ink with lots of shade. Alexa, stop. And, uh,. <clears throat> It's very nice. I like it. It does have some problems on some papers, but we'll talk about that later. Here is our ink, sw ink swatch, and water resistance test shows that I might not want to use this on the outside of an envelope for fear it may wash away. And here is our toilet paper chromatography. This is a very interesting ink. There is like some brown along the edges, and then right about here there is some orange. And then right here is some yellow, and then right, just right along the edge of that, there's green. There are these green patches you can't really see, which is very strange. Very nice rainbowy looking ink. All right, let's do some paper review, shall we? This is the Pen and Gear Memo book from Walmart.com. Oi, feather like a chicken, bled through the page. We're going to find a lot of that today. This is a lightweight traveler's notebook paper. No feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. This is super lightweight traveler's notebook paper. Had a little trouble catching the ink and normal ghosting. <coughs> This is Moleskin 70 GSM, Feather Like a Chicken, Bled Through the Page, 100 GSM Ayush. No feathering, no bleeding, no gusting. This is 52 GSM Tumaway River Paper, no feathering, no bleeding, no gusting. <coughs> this is the Jot Journal from the Dollar Tree. Feather like a chicken, blade to the page. This is Nemesine 80 GSM dot, pa dot pad. No feathering, no bleeding, barely any ghosting. This is Oxford Optic Paper. Feather like a chicken, blade to the page. The Premier Premium Journal from the 99 cent store. Feather like a chicken, blood through the page. Claire Fontaine, 90 GSM. Spread into the page and it did bleed through. Lamy Booklet, 90 GSM. Spread into the page and it bled through. Exceed 100 GSM heavyweight paper from Walmart.com. Spread into the paper and bled through. Unison 2018. No feathering, no bleeding, no gusting. Only one that didn't bleed or ghost. Unison Composition Book 2022. Feather Like a Chicken, Bled Through the Page. Up and Up Composition Book. Feather Like a Chicken, Bled Through the Page. True Red Composition Book from Staples.com. Feather Like a Chicken. Blend to the page. 
buffet handmade paper from Italy. Feather like a chicken. No bleeding, no ghosting. The Nanami Seven Seas 68 GSM Tumawe River. No feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. Rodia Dot Pad 80 GSM. Feather like a chicken, bled through the page. CVS Caliber Notebook Paper. Here is going to be the real test of time. No feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. Excellent paper. Oxford Notebook Paper. No feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. Made five star notebook paper. Spread it on the page and bled through. Made five st uh, wide rolled notebook paper. Feather like a chicken, bled right through the page. HP Premium 32 pound copy paper. Little spread into the page. And it did ghost through. Akabe cross section pad. Feather like a chicken, bled through the page. JNB copper plate graph pad from johnneilbooks.com. Spread into the page and it bled through. Original crown mill 100 GSM paper. Feather like a chicken, bled through the page. So, I cannot recommend this ink to anyone unless you're using Tomoe River, CVS Caliber Notebook Paper, or um, um, Stanford. Stanford? No. Oh god, my brain is tarting out really hard right now. I don't know why. Oxford. Oxford notebook paper. <clears throat> you can find this stuff on Amazon. It looks like this. It's made in Vietnam. Made in... Made in Vietnam. It's good stuff. I've never had a problem with it. And it's re relatively cheap. So. <clears throat> okay, let's do a comparison panel. Okay. I don't really know what color this is, so I'm going to go with orange. And we will see if it leans into the yellow department. Because it does kind of have a little bit of a yellowy flavor to it. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> this is... Birmingham Pen Company Apple Fit Apple oh, Apple Fish Snail Apple Snail Skim through these. This is Diatrementus Mahatma Gandhi. Private Reserve Orange Silver Sailor Manyo Yamabuki. Ferris Wheel Press Sparkling Champagne, Birmingham Solar Storm, <clears throat> Ferris Wheel Press Autumn in Auburn, Monteverde Mango Moose, Robert Oster NG Special, Operation Overlord Orange, Apache Sunset, Stipula Saffron, MMD California Sunset, Lamy Mango. Those are the oranges. Let's take a look at some yellow inks because I think that this is going to land right next to some of these. Alright, this is Pure Pens Cotswolds. This is very, very similar. Robert Oster African Gold. A little more gold. Diamond Louise. Diamond Golden Sands. 
Robert Oster NG Special, Malt Blanc Gold and Yellow, Bakersfield Food Color Yellow, Diamine Amber, Roar and Clinger Helianthus. This is like way in the orangey yellow department. Krishna Primary Yellow, and Aurelium Goldfinch Yellow, Diamine Gold Star, Diatramentus Document Yellow, Sailor Manyo Yamabuki, Noodlers Apache Sunset, MMD Golden Afternoon, uh, La Arte Saint Pastillier, Joan Jasmine, Robert Oster Chartreuse, Robert Oster Aussie Gold, Diamond Candlelight. These are like cousins. Van Diemen's Harvest Apple Cider. These are super similar too. Pen BBS 399, Noodler's Yellow Jacket, Platinum Citrus Black, Ferris Wheel Press Goose Poupon, Troublemaker Espana Boulevard, Horseradish Mustard, Dust Storm, Pannonia Dungo, Noodler's Yellow, and Diamond Sunshine Yellow. Well, are you guys looking for a bleedy yellow? Let me know in the comment section below. <laughs> That is all for today. I want to thank you all for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed this one. I hope that you learned something. Please share this video with your friends. Follow me on social media. Like, comment, subscribe, ring the little bell. Make sure it's set to all so when I upload new content, YouTube notifies you and I will be back very soon with another video. So take care until then. Okay, love you. Bye. Have a great day.